When the name NASA echoes through our minds, we conjure images of legendary vessels like the towering Saturn V rocket, the awe-inspiring space shuttle, and the current pride, the SLS. Yet, lost in the pages of space history, there's another rocket, a workhorse that once graced the skies, boasting nearly a hundred launches. Impressive, isn't it? However, the relentless passage of time brings change. With the arrival of Elon Musk and SpaceX, a seismic shift reverberated through the cosmos. They challenged the norms, brandishing a philosophy distinctly their own, and disrupted the status quo with an unprecedented cadence of launches. SpaceX achieved what seemed implausible merely two decades ago, a staggering 100 rocket launches in a single year. It's a feat so audacious that it eclipses the memory of the aforementioned rocket, casting it into the shadows of oblivion. In today's riveting episode of Great SpaceX, we embark on a journey to unearth the identity of this forgotten rocket, exploring why its legacy failed into obscurity and how the thunderous roar of SpaceX's rockets has eclipsed even the renowned achievements of NASA. Traveling back to the heart of the last century, we're transported to the genesis of the legendary space race between two superpowers, the US and the Soviet Union. It was in 1957 when the Soviet Union etched its name in history by achieving a groundbreaking feat, the triumphant launch of the Sputnik satellite. This monumental achievement catapulted the nation to the forefront, marking it as the first to send an artificial object into the vast expanse of space. The pivotal moment marked the inception of the space race between the two nations. Eager not to be outpaced by their counterparts, the U.S. swiftly delved into research on robust rockets capable of launching payloads and astronauts into the cosmos. Among these endeavors was the inception of the Solid Controlled Orbital Utility Test System, more commonly known as SCOUT in 1957. Developed at the NACA facility located at Langley Center, the Scout rocket harnessed engines fueled entirely by solid propellants. Its dimensions were modest, yet purposeful, standing at approximately 23 meters in height, 1 meter in diameter, boasting a dry mass exceeding 16 tons, a launch mass of 21 and a half tons, and with the capacity to ferry a payload of 30 kilograms to low Earth orbit. The Scout rocket comprised four distinct stages. Its initial stage, known as Algol, amalgamated elements from the Jupiter Senior and Navy Polaris rockets. Specifically, it drew its hardware foundation from the liquid-fueled Jupiter Senior design, which NASA modified to use solid fuel akin to the Navy's Polaris rocket. Following this, the subsequent stage, named Castor, utilized engines derived from the Army's Sergeant Surface-to-Surface -surface rocket. Stages 3 and 4, designated Antares and Altair, were adaptations from the Navy's Vanguard rockets crafted by NASA's Langley Research Center. In essence, Scout integrated varied rocket designs into a singular, versatile prototype designed for space launches. Spanning an operational tenure of 35 years from 1960 to 1994, the Scout executed a total of 99 missions. In its initial phase, the majority of Scout's flights were test missions. The inaugural launch on April 18th of 1960 unfortunately ended in failure. However, it achieved its first successful orbital mission on February 16th of 1961, carrying the 7kg Explorer 9 satellite into orbit. Its swan song occurred on May 9th of 1994 at Vandenberg Space Force Base, deploying the Scout G1 version to carry the Miniature Sensor Technology Integration Series 2, or MSTI-2, military spacecraft. The Scout rocket initially found its primary purpose in launching small satellites and various payloads into Earth's orbit for NASA and the USAF. However, during its latter years, it's predominantly served the USAF as NASA gradually shifted toward utilizing alternative vehicles. Most active during the 60s, the Scout's launch frequency dwindled in the subsequent decades. A significant contribution of the Scout lies in its pioneering design, introducing what later became known as the hot staging mechanism observed in Russian rockets like the N-1 and the current SpaceX Starship. This innovative mechanism enables upper stage engines to become active 
with as soon as they position atop the lower stage, offering a solution that bolsters flight performance. Despite its extensive service history and numerous launches, the Scout rocket didn't command as much attention as other iconic rockets, notably the Saturn V, which basked in the limelight of glory. The Saturn rocket family, though launching only 32 missions, a mere third of the Scout's achievements, accomplished monumental feats that elevated human exploration by landing astronauts on the moon. This historic achievement tipped the scales in the U.S.-Soviet space competition, thrusting the Saturn rockets into the forefront of attention. The Saturn V, in particular, stands as a towering figure in rocketry, boasting a staggering height of 111 meters and a diameter of 10.1, earning it the prestigious title of the world's largest rocket for decades. The sheer magnitude in its size overshadowed the impression left by the Scout, making the Saturn V an unparalleled symbol. Following the Saturn V, the Space Shuttle captured the spotlight in the U.S. aerospace industry. Its innovative blend of aviation and space technology was unparalleled at the time, facilitating crucial missions, notably contributing to the construction of the ISS. The Space Shuttle's remarkable accomplishments far surpassed the capabilities of the Scout, solidifying its legacy in space history. In the present era, the legacy of the Scout rocket seems to fade further into obscurity with the emergence of new, mighty rockets, particularly those from SpaceX. The Falcon 9, after 14 years of service, has shattered historical records, boasting over 280 launches to date. Last year alone, it soared past the decades-long record of 47 launches held by Russia's Soyuz rocket, achieving a remarkable feat with 60 successful missions. This year, its launch count has exceeded 85, surpassing its own record, with SpaceX aiming for a groundbreaking 300 Falcon 9 launches early next year. The frequency of launches is on track to potentially reach 100 per year, surpassing the 35 years it took the Scout to achieve its 99. The Falcon 9 has solidified its position as NASA's primary launch vehicle, supporting crucial missions like supplying the ISS. Meanwhile, the Falcon Heavy, renowned for its historic 2018 launch carrying the Tesla Roadster and Starman, has seen continued development. SpaceX has conducted nine Falcon Heavy missions to date, notably launching five this year, exceeding its previous cumulative launches. The trajectory suggests Falcon Heavy will further strengthen its capabilities in the coming years. Enter Starship, the colossal rocket standing at 121 meters tall with a 9 meter diameter, dethroning the Saturn V to become the world's largest rocket. Powered by the mighty Raptor engines, a recent flight showcased the combined thrust of 33 engines, exceeding 7,000 tons, a historical high. Starship continuously advances after each flight, inching closer to reaching orbit. Notably, it leads the aerospace industry trend by employing methane as fuel and focusing on cost optimization. SpaceX's trio of rockets dominates the aerospace industry. Beyond their sheer power, they pioneer cost-effective reuse strategies and unparalleled feat in the industry. Their influence arguably surpasses the achievements of the Saturn V and the Space Shuttle. Perhaps the scout's fading memory finds its explanation here. With these innovative rockets, mentioning any one of them alone is enough to overshadow the once-famed Scout rocket. The triumphs of bygone eras have gradually receded, making way for the dawn of new rocketry. NASA's esteemed rockets Saturn V, the Space Shuttle, and lesser-known ones like Scout etched their names in history, fortifying the United States aerospace dominance. Now, a new breed of rockets, spearheaded by SpaceX, stands poised to inherit these legacies, scripting fresh chapters of American greatness. While Saturn V and the Space Shuttle often seize the spotlight, Scout remains a lesser-known part of NASA's storied fleet from the last century. Yet despite its quieter reputation, Scout played a pivotal role, silently laying the groundwork for what would become the world's preeminent aerospace organization. Well, folks, that's about it for today's episode. Thank you so much for tuning in, and if you want to support our channel even further, you can hop on over to our Patreon through the link in the description below. Sign up and become a patron today to gain access to exclusive content. Sounds exciting, right? In any case, we still appreciate your generosity and your passion for space exploration. As always, this is Kevin from Great SpaceX, and until next time, keep looking up, and happy holidays.